Welcome to Electra Online. As a boy growing up in Belgium, I used to live in a third-story apartment near a fairly busy highway. And on the days that I got bored, I used to sit in front of the window with a sheet of paper and I had the names of the different car types that would be driving past on the road. And I would keep a tally of the type of cars that would come by. If I saw a Volkswagen, I would make a little line on the Volkswagen. If I saw a Ford, I would draw a little line. If I saw a Simca, I would draw a little line. And so I kept track to see what type of cars were the most common on the road. Hmm, I guess since we didn't have a television or we didn't have video games, I had to find something to do when I wasn't with my friends. Anyway, here's what that means, taking a tally or keeping a tally of something. So let's say we have 25 letter grades and want to know how much of each type I have. The way to do that is just to go down the line and whenever we see one of the letter grades, we make a little line next to the grade that we found. So for B, I have a one B here, I have a C, I have another C, I have another B, I have a D, I have an A, a B, a C, another B, another C, a D, an F, and a C. Now that will be my fifth C. What you do then is you simply draw a line across like that. That gives us five and that way it's easy to see how many fives you have. So now we go over here, we have another C, we have a D, another C, a B. Again, I draw a line across from my fifth B, another A, another F, another A, another F, another B, another C, another B, and another A. And so now you can see very quickly counting how many of each we have. We have four A's, we have seven B's, we have eight C's, three D's, and three F's. And see, that is what we mean by keeping a tally. And it's a very quick, effective method to take a group of data and see what your distribution is, your frequency distribution, relative to what we have here, relative to the data set that we started with. So it's a handy method, a clever method, and a very quick method. And notice that every time you get to the fifth of an item, then you simply draw a line across and you can very easily just add up the groupings of fives to see how many total data points you have of that particular type. And that is what's meant by keeping a tally.